Hi everyone, it's my favorite time of the week. It's Fan Mail Friday and um, I asked, you delivered, and you delivered more for the first Fan Mail Friday of February than I received at Christmas. Now, Christmas happened over a series of weeks, but let me just tell you, yesterday there was overnight mail, there were overnight packages. You really like an assignment and you like a deadline. So how fun, I, 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 I definitely need to know more. You bowled me over with the amazing things that are in this beautiful array of creativity and love and support. And let me just tell you, it's going to be a minute. So hopefully you got a cup of tea and you're sitting down and you're um, going to enjoy all of all that I have enjoyed this week. So let's start off with my friend Susan and her happy anniversary easel card. And what's fun is that in the easel is a picture of she and I. Look at that. <laughs> Susan. Oh, you're so cute. And I love this and love the fact that she actually gave me a list of all the collections that she has had from me over the last um, 25 years. And it's a list, meaning that the whole, the whole enchilada is here. And Susan, I can't believe that you have it all. So congratulations. <laughs> I'm going to have to use the list for my own personal reference. Okay, now this is from Arlene, and this is so beautiful. This is her first card for Fan Mail Friday, a beautiful easel card. And thank you for coming to create, Arlene. That was really, really sweet. And I'm going to go kind of fast, so if you're um, already worried if your card isn't in here, I did take away all of the... Um, ones for Valentine's Day that weren't a first uh, so that I could show them next week so that we have lots of Valentines. Okay, this is from Lori, and this is the first time she used a jacket die from us, and how beautiful. It's a very etro-looking card. I, I love it, and so many of you are wishing me happy anniversary, which is very kind. All right, this is from Sandy. This is so fun. Okay, so let me show you both of her beautiful cards with the Valentine um, and all heart dies. Valentine doilies. It's her first fan mail Friday, and she's got everything in ivory and gold, and it, she makes cards for our soldiers. So I just think that that is so nice, and you're, she's, you're right. Being humbled in a small way, how to make a simple card or a scrapbook page can mean so much to someone and show how you care. Now that is true. And that's what we're doing here, right? We're sharing the love and we're sharing our creativity on a, on a weekly basis. And lucky me. Okay, here we go. This is from, oh, isn't this fun? Look at this. Okay, sorry. That's Bonnie. Bonnie, how pretty. I love this little window box card full, full of hearts. And it says, Happy Valentine's Day. Um, and I think there was a, there was a, oh, it was definite. Here we go. I knew there was some firsts in here. The, this is fun. This is one of her first papers from me, and this is called Climbing Rose. And it is, she went back to the archives, and she's using it for the first time. I love it. She's got all the, ex, all the collections just like Susan. All right, this card has a lot of first. It's the first window box I made from scratch. The first time using slits for embellish, oh, stilts for embellishments, and the first time using your XL envelopes. Okay, Bonnie, that's fun. I like it. I do feel kind of guilty about these XL envelopes. I can't believe they cost $3.50 to mail. Mm, okay, me in the post office. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look at this beautiful, beautiful anniversary card from Beth. And look, she sent two, and this one is for Valentine's Day. And I think this is where, yeah, here we go. Here's all the firsts. Ta-da! Look at this. Congratulations on your first products. The first time I've written to you was first introduced many, many years ago at Scrapbook Expos and QVC. And enclosed are the photos of the very first template sets. Okay, this is fun. Okay, so this was from Plaid. I love this. I'm going to dig this out. I have this here in the archive. These were also from Plaid, and they were templates for making envelopes and envelope liners. And look at her first beautiful, beautiful scrapbook page. I think that you told me who this is for. This is your... Oh, so beautiful, her great niece. Okay, I love it, and I think you did an amazing job. And I tell you, just wait till you get it. I need to go a little faster because... The heartfelt messages in this stuff is amazing. Okay, look, 
Happy 25th anniversary from Carolyn. Isn't that pretty? And look, we have a second one. I think she couldn't choose. She, she made mul um, multiples for me. Wait, there's Valentine's Day as well. You just put it all in here. Happy Valentine's Day, happy anniversary, 25th anniversary. And here it is, this is really fun. Okay, it's her first time making a card from scratch with the e new easy easel die. Using, first time using part of the square card die set. First time using the new alphabet dies. And the silver card is another one from scratch and using the A and the silver foil card stock. And then she, the first card she made with the B mine card kit. First time she ever sent me a card and she sent me three. <laughs> I told you you loved an assignment and a deadline. Thank you, Carolyn. That's just so sweet. All right, Alice, 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 this is so pretty. Look, I love this. It says Create Atlanta 2019. Happy anniversary. And this is, uh, she's retired and looking for a hobby, and now she has an Anna Griffin obsession. <laughs> this is the first time that she sent a card in, and I love it. So, Alice, I look forward to meeting you, hopefully, in November. And then, oh, this is from Penny. Look, Penny. Oh, how pretty. Penny, um, you're using your bows. Okay. Oh, because I'm grateful. So she it's a thank you for the green paper, and this is the very first pop-up card she made. Now, Penny, now that's interesting because this is from, gosh, this is from summer before last. The 16 or 17, I'm not sure. It's been a while. I love that you're using this card, the card making kit, and you did it in such a beautiful way. Thanks, Penny. Okay, uh, this, here's one that came, like I said, stuff started coming in the overnight mail, and the, just I want to make sure and show this because this one is from Tom. Look, he loves the beautiful stick pins, the hat pins, and that looks like a box of candy. And there's a little gift in here, and it's so pretty. It's a world's smallest pulley card. Ta-da! <laughs> oh, Tom, I love this, and I love this little Valentine. Oh, and it went, it says it's from Earl. Isn't that fun? Okay, and just, I hope you're feeling better, and thank you so much for your letter, and I, I can't imagine living without fingerprints, but I'm glad that they're coming back, and thank you for your beautiful um, message to me, and if I can lift you up in any way, let me, let me know. Thank you so much. All right, next we have... Look at this, <laughs> here we go, more antiques everyone. Just marvel, <laughs> marvel at the fact that that beautiful, that be look, at, I'm gonna pull this so that you can see. All right, do you see all these layers? All this beautiful stuff. Okay, antiques, look, antiques, more antiques. Oh, it's an antique, an <laughs> Anna Griffin fan mail. I found this card at an antique show last year, and this is from Loretta, and she, it just screamed Anna Griffin, and this is the first card that she has sent as well. Look at that. Oh, I love these, and I just, oh, I adore, adore the antique things, and thank you so much, and isn't that, isn't that special? Thank you. Okay, Loretta's first card. I like it. First card, including gifts. Look at this one. Okay, so this, okay, this is, oh, Tammy, that's right, I should have known that at first glance. Look at this, Tammy's first shaker card with all this special sequin glitter and words inside, and it's, um, it's to Joe and Georgie and me and about Valentine's Day, and it's the first card, first Valentine ever, first one with the card kit. It's the first one she ever made for me. Isn't that fun? Okay, like I said, there's more Valentines coming next week, uh, but I, I just want to make sure that I'm getting to all the first. This is from Cindy, and this is so pretty. Look, these are some of the very first Anna Griffin scrapbook papers in that background, and ta-da! Cindy's first uh, swivel and pop card with the dies. She loves it, and it's the first of many, many more, and I think that's amazing. So fun. Okay, I have to put these back because I can't. I have to keep myself somewhat organized in the fan mail. It's getting um, to be a lot to manage. You guys are amazing. Okay, 25th, look at this. Okay, I love that. I love the letters and it's, 
if you see me at the end of the day in my office, I'm sitting down and I'm opening all of this and I'm reading and I'm smiling and people come in and say, what are you smiling about? And I was like, just read this stuff. This is amazing. It's, I, it's such an honor. Uh, this is from Cindy and it's her first uh, time she sent a card and she absolutely loves all the products. And she is, let's see, she has a request. She wants some, oh, you want some flowers. Okay. I got flowers. We want some more favorite flowers. I love it, and so I will definitely get on that and put that on our infamous product request list. And this, all right. This is from Sue. Look, so proud of you. Ready, everybody? Ta-da! <laughs> on your 25th anniversary. That's beautiful. That's an amazing card. And this, let's look, okay, just want to make sure I got all the first. Yes, first card and first letter, encouraging. <laughs> I was encouraged by listening to you get on the bus and send the card, and I've been holding back because my skills are less than perfect. Okay, now that's not true. That's not true. This is an amazing moment. All of this is about you making something for me, I want to make something for you, and I just, I just love, I love that you did this for me, and I hope you'll stay warm in northern Minnesota. This is a, Fan Mail Friday's her favorite day of the week, too. I love it. Okay, well, thank you for being part of it this week, Sue, and so nice to meet you all over Fan Mail. Okay, look, this is a book. Ready? This is from Kathy, and then Life is Better with Friends. And then, thank you for making my life happier by crafting. And look, it's all Eleanor, the Eleanor collection. So beautiful. Oh, and thank you so much. So what is this? Okay, it's her first time sending a project, a whole project. Thank you. And thank you for making such beautiful cards. All right, this is, um, she wants me to make a glue gun. I've got one. I, I, I've got one in the works. I just don't like it as much as... I want to, so it's, in, it's kind of stalled at the moment. Okay, Kay, this is cute. I saved this one from last week. This is from Kay, and Kay's first time making a flip card. Isn't that fun? And I, she was so cute. She's like, I don't think I did it right. I just sent you a bunch of firsts. And then like, this is her first, this is her um, first time sending two cards for Fan Mail Friday and the flip card and the floral impression. First, first one from the floral impressions card kit. Now that's pretty, that's pretty amazing. That was one of the very first ones that I ever made. Thank you, Kay. Love it. Hope you're staying warm. Cold up there in Fargo. Okay, Linda. Oh, look at this. This is Linda's first card. And so beautiful. I like your combination of papers and colors and all the things that are here. Yes, very first, very first card. Oh. Thanks for sending us. Thanks for sending us your address. And, you know, if it's okay, I'm going to start corresponding with you. <laughs> Hopefully that's okay. Okay, look, now this is fun. This is, okay. All right, Annie, Laura, look at your beautiful fan card. Okay, and I just want to show you this picture that's included in the card. I'm going to flip it over. It's going to say, I'm packed and ready for create. And she is. She's ready for Atlanta. And we hope to meet you soon as well. Oh, this is one I saved from last week, too, because I thought that was really fun. First card, and she, oh, there's a letter. And, okay, don't want to get all this mixed up. Okay. Now, this one also came in the overnight, the overnight mail, and this is from Mary, and look how beautiful all that. This is a traditional decoupage. I love it, and thank you for your kindness. Okay, Miss Mary Baker, I love you. All right, this is her first card ever sent for Fan Mail Friday, and what's so special about this is that she says, I've begun so many let thank you letters over the years that were never finished, and I was raised in the South, and I know better. <laughs> oh, she grew up in Georgia. I love this. Thank you for telling me about you. And, oh, and con happy birthday early. And you thought, oh, this is really good. Everybody listen up. She said, for years I thought I needed to produce a totally original card. After all, I've been mostly copying your beautiful cards, and how could I come up with an original design? That had me stymied for years. Why didn't I just write a note on the white paper? I believe I even told you one year that I would do that. Fan Mail Fridays helped me understand that I didn't have to design an original card, but I still couldn't manage. It's because you mean so much to me. Oh, 
And thank you, Anna Griffin, for gen your generously sharing your creativity, your products, your energy, and your sunshine with the whole world. And I have so much to thank you for. But this is a start. Oh, Mary. Mm. Okay. Big hug across the television. Okay. Whew. All right. So this is from Brenda. We just move on because I can't cry yet. I, I these things move me to tears every single week. Look, this is her first card. F thank you for the fabulous team, and uh, I love it. We have heard from so many new fans today, and look at this. This is the first fairy tale scenes card, and it's from Frida. Oh, she loves it. I'm so glad. It's her second card for Fan Mail Friday, but her first of the fairy tale scenes. All right, and Susan, oh, this is fun. We're really looking at a blast from the past of older cards. Happy anniversary. I like that we're spelling it with Anna. First time she used the fancy flourish dies, and she's got, oh, oh, really, that's so fun, a really beautiful old card making kit. I love it. Okay, not only are we doing anniversaries, we're, do, we're taking out the archives, we're using things, and that's how much fun it is. All right, this is Judith, and Judith, this is her first card, and she's used all of these things from the, for the very first time, and she is encouraging me to make bookmarks. So I think that's so beautiful, and your letter is so kind, and thank you. I'm so glad that you reached out and gave me one of your firsts. I'm honored. Okay, look at this one. It says first, everybody. <laughs> first time, I think this is, this is from Marita. Yes, first time she wove the paper. First time she attended Create. First time she won a prize. First time she used Fancy Flourish too. First time she did the weaving. That's all kinds of firsts. <laughs> what am I going to come up with next? All right, look at this. Whatever comes after 25th, girl, there are no numbers after 25. How funny. I love that you're altering these things. And Mary, that's hysterical. That <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, first cards. All right, happy 25th. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. This is from Paulette, and she's singing. I love this. Oh, Paulette, wait, we met at the Tampa airport. You had just come home from a cruise, right? And thanks for reminding me about that. She comes up and she says, are you Anna Griffin? And I had just gotten off of HSN, and I laughed and said yes, and, and I asked her had she watched, and she said no, because she had just been on a cruise for a week. Look, she wrote me a song. <laughs> Okay, I, I have some very talented, musically talented people in this building, and let me just tell you, we're going to play this, Paulette. We're going to have to hear it. I, uh, mm, I play the piano, but I, and I can read this, I just can't wait. Maybe you should have sung it to me. <laughs> Recorded it. All right, Celia, look how beautiful. Celia, this is her first card from, to us, and spinning, oh, thank you. Very first from the Be Mine easel card making kit. All right. I love it. That means we're getting the stuff out of the drawer, out of the box, and you're doing it for the first time. This is pretty Michelle. It's her first card of first, first Valentine she sent me, and the first with the four corners dies, and she loves the 3D border folders. Now, those are oldies but goodies. Thank you, Michelle. Hope you are having a happy Valentine's Day, too. That's so nice. Okay, Linda, happy anniversary. I love that we're uh, continuing to graffiti the stickers with Anna. <laughs> and she's excited. Okay, she's, oh, that's really nice. So thank you for what you do for the craft community and make us novices look good. Okay, no, it's all about you. You look good already. Just amazing. Okay, now I see a really oldie but goodie right here. This is from Ellen. Okay, this came in a little bitty box from Plaid, and this was probably in 2001, and it had little metal charms and little epoxy stickers, and look, Ellen, Ellen has done everything about it. Uh, I, lo <laughs> I love it. It's, not, it's definitely not a first, but it's one of my firsts here um, to, to experience with you. I love it. Old stuff, made new. All right, this is from Jenny. Oh, how pretty. Happy Valentine's. First Valentine I've ever made with So Smitten Card Kit. That's a beautiful kit, isn't it? That's one of my favorites for Valentine's. Okay, Roberta. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Happy anniversary. We got it all mixed up. We got Valentine's, we got anniversary, we got firsts, we've got everything. Let you know I've been a fan since 2004. 
on QVC and the first card I made with the square cut and embossed dies and the six by six patterns. That's so fun. That means that you, you just bought those and that means you've already made something and that means that you're not holding on to it, that you're sharing the love. Okay, this is so pretty. Look at this. Happy anniversary and the, from Sue. Congratulations. This is my first card for Fan Mail Friday. And years ago, I purchased the stamps at a craft store. And last March, I rediscovered you on HSN at the beginning of my retirement. Wow. Well, happy retirement <laughs> to you. And I hope you'll keep in touch because that's it's a lot of fun to read all this mail. So I just need to get busy and send you some. Okay, this is from Beverly. This is pretty. You just got those as well. Oh, pictures. Happy 25th anniversary and uh, first card I've sent you and all of her AG supplies. Thank you. Oh, it's Bev. Okay, Bev. I got to get, get everybody's names right. Okay, this is from Saravi and this is really fun. I want you to see one. Hopefully, yeah, I'm going to hold it up so you can see how beautiful that she colored the flocked paper. And then, <laughs> look at this. On the inside, this is, this is Alex, well, my son, Alex, and he colored the flock paper. And I think this is beautiful. And so, Mom, can you spend some time coloring with me and look at what they did? They just made the most beautiful things. And you, and you sent it to me. Should I send it back to you? This is too precious to keep. Um, gosh, thank you. And it's beautiful and inspiring to me. Speaking of inspiring, look at this. This is, okay, the tissue envelope. All right, ready? Do you see, can you see everybody? <laughs> oh, all right, I love, 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 love this. Hello, Anna, this is from Katherine Setzer. And we all know that you say cats rule and dogs drool, but I'm on the fence. You see? Unsure of which the team to be on and what should I choose, team purr or team woof. And this is her first appearance in Fan Mail Friday with her fur babies. And don't you just love it? And thanks for including me in that amazing card. <laughs> Catherine, you, you definitely um, hit it out of the park there. Okay, now Fan Mail Friday wouldn't be complete without Jeannie. Now look at this, Jeannie, look at the scene. I want, to show, I want you to see the cat jumping out of the ceiling. <laughs> or off the ceiling. This is so cute. And what's so fun is that you, this is her, um, oh yeah, okay. First card challenge. And I sanded the card stock for the first time and loved the transformation. And yes, Billions is back on in March. Yay! Okay, remember Jeannie's the one that tells me to watch TV? All right. <laughs> Now, we have a very special gift from, from Sandra, and here's her card, and that's so pretty, and then look at the envelopes all embossed, and then here's to celebrating you, and she wrote me a beautiful letter because she came to create four, and then she made me a happy anniversary angel. Look, there's me. <laughs> oh, she's so soft and squishy. I love it. Okay, right, ta-da. Sandra, you are very, very, very thoughtful, and thank you very much. And um, last but certainly not least, I got an entire box of things from Terry, Terry Thompson, and I'm going to show you. So we made, she made the boxes, and then on the inside, there's a beautiful card. This is all about firsts, okay? So look at this beautiful 25th anniversary and Valentine's Day, and, and it's a whole thing of firsts. And she loves all the dies and the vintage cards that she's sending, and she had so much fun making all of these things. And let me tell you, it was a joy to open and play with all of this. Okay, so look at first, look at this beautiful envelope <laughs> made with the Valentine's paper. Look at the embossing. Okay, and then all these beautiful antique cards that didn't come this way. I know because you made these beautiful little background cards in the gold to highlight your presence. And see, see, gorgeous. I always said that someday people would collect the cards that I made like I collect these. Isn't that an interesting thought? That was I, was I making tomorrow's heirlooms right now? I think so. Okay, look at this. This is also from Terry. Look at the, 
the world's thickest beautiful easel card. Would you see that? Look, it says Anna. And it stands. And then the end all, the end all be all of easel cards is right here. I've run out of, I've run out of room. Okay, look. I was showing this to somebody last night as I was leaving the office and how like every single thing on this easel card except for the little lace was made with one of our products in glitter paper and metallic paper and I can't imagine how long that took you to make. But I'm eternally grateful for all of that work and all of that thought and all of that care and it smells good too. Isn't that something? Uh, okay. You did great. <laughs> you did amazing. You blew the socks off of me. Uh, well, I don't wear socks. But anyway, <laughs> you blew the doors off the building. How's that? And the mail truck. And I think, um, you know, one of my uh, second favorite movie at Christmas is Miracle on 34th Street. When, um, when the, the, he walks up to the judge with all the big box of mail and dumps it in front of the judge that there is a Santa Claus. Well, my God, it's Anna's anniversary and fans are <laughs> shouting it from the rooftops. And I just want to say thank you. And thanks for participating in the first uh, Fan Mail Friday of February. Um, start working on March now, March 1st, OK? And we'll do this again. Uh, <laughs> all right, bye for now.